hello everyone thank you so much for tuning in and welcome back to another video so in today's video i am reviewing some items that i purchased on amazon today i have two shirts two dresses and two bags one of the items is this shirt that i'm wearing now this is from a company called explora because i will only give my honest review and this is the packaging that they sent the shirt in so this is the first one it's a gray shirt both of these shirts were $20 and I ordered them in a size small. So I'll just show this shirt to start with. So here's the label that comes up on the shirt. Care instructions on the back. The tag is here. It's a t-shirt and it, it expands at the bottom, it widens. It has this lace embroidery that goes around the front rim and the front is a little higher than the back. I'm just gonna do a quick close up of the material. It's of course hard to see what it would really be, but just gives you a general idea. It's like, um, what's it made out of? It's a blended material. It's thin, but not too see-through. So it's nice for the summertime. And here's a close up of the lace embroidered part. And this one is also a size small. This one's a bit different. It's the same type of material. I ordered it in a blue. And both of the shirts come in a variety of colors. This one just has buttons on the side and it has a little ruching there. This is really cute. So this is the buttons up close. really cute how this part is and it has a nice flow to it it has this banded part at the bottom it adds a little fitted part nice sleeves nice neckline So the next thing I have is this dress. It has three quarter length sleeves. It has a high waist and it's floor length. This comes in different patterns and colors. It has a tiny bit of sheen to it, just a little. It's really soft. Mine is a size medium. This is a really, really comfortable dress. This is a medium. This one comes in multiple colors too. So it's white and another color. So this one is the green. It's Somewhat high-waisted, not too much. These are to the elbow, so elbow length sleeves. It has loops on it, and it comes with a tie. And it has some, a bit of pleating at the top, in the front and the back. And this is um, like, um, I'll say, calf length. The material is nice, it's not too thick. It's breathable in the summer. It feels good on the skin. Both of the shirts, both the shirts and both of the dresses are very airy and feel very nice on the skin. So the first bag that I wanna share is this. It's um, faux leather, but it's really cute. It has a nice handle. This is a transition bag, so it transitions from a handbag to a crossbody bag also to a backpack. I'm going to show you how it does all those things, but here's a close up of the bag. And then this pulls up 
and it goes over the shoulder like this. And then if you just let go of that part and you see these become the backpack straps. So then you just pull it to buy this one and then you can, it, it stops it from going all the way through because of this thicker part here. And this is how it sits on your back. Then I'll just show you some of the little pockets, the way it opens up. It opens with the two snaps here and then it has a zippered part here. So it's from added safety. Someone can't just walk up and open the bag. You do have to unzip it. And then it has these two snaps on the side, on either side, that keeps the bag pretty firmly closed. So this would be the inside of it. And then if you want to open it up, you can just undo the snaps and then it widens like this. And it has these two interior pockets here. here and one here and then it has this zipper pocket here all of these are not actually too deep they just sit things just right so if you move the bag around a lot the things kind of come out of there but the pockets are nice if you hold your bag upright they won't fall out and then it has this pocket in the back which is not a deep pocket either it just goes to just to there and it has a little handle here and the strap. So I'll just show how it looks with a crossbody. So you have to just loosen the straps. This can be made a little longer. So you have this much room left to make it even longer. But just to show you how it looks as a crossbody, this is how it would go. And the thicker part of the strap would be right at your shoulder. The next bag is this one. This one's pretty cute. This can either be a shoulder strap bag or you can carry it by the handle or a backpack. And what I really like about this bag is that you can't get into majority of the space until you open the back. So this is the, this is the main compartment of the bag right here. And when you open it up, it has these holders on the side that keeps your stuff in and you can just reach in there and grab everything. It has this inside pocket here and it has two little pockets that sit in here but these are pretty much useless because nothing will stay in that. This bag is pretty, it flops around. It's really cute but it doesn't hold its shape so when you put the bag down the things that you put in these little pockets will come right out. So it just zips up. The zipper goes all the way around to this side or all the way to this side. Or of course you can just put it up to the middle. And it, this is where your back is so no one can go in while you're holding it. It does have these two side pockets here. You can of course put nothing in there if you like or just put something that you don't really care about in, in case you're like in a busy place where you're worried about somebody opening your bag and reaching in. So those are just side pockets. It also has these two side pockets. These are pretty deep. Same on this side. And it has this little poof here. It's really soft like rabbit fur. And that comes off. It has a little clamp that holds it. And then this is the strap for the shoulder. Or the handle to just hold it and then the straps which are adjustable you have this much room to adjust it I keep mine up on this part if you keep it on here it doesn't really slide is a little harder for it to move so the buckle doesn't slide if you go to this part the buckle tends to slide I think this is a perfect bag to use if you're going to an amusement park 
or if you're on vacation because all of your belongings are secure back in here and it's really cute too and there are things that I recently purchased or I've had for a while but um, if you're interested in anything the links are in the description box and I think I don't think I gave the prices of anything but the description box will show the price again thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one